GDINT Advisor in CREO 12 introduces many new improvements that will boost your productivity. The first enhancement is related to the count of disjointed surface regions that belong to a single CREO surface. When such a surface will be collected for a new feature in GDINT Advisor, it will identify and list the number of surfaces that are contained by that surface. GDNT Advisor now also supports sketched holes, so when I collect such a hole for a new functional feature, it will identify all the holes from the sketch and will include them in an associated pattern feature. Another enhancement is related to a new tolerance combination that is now supported for patterns. In this case, the yellow color indicates to me that it is not enough to constrain only the position and orientation of the pattern, but I actually also need to constrain its form. This combination is now enabled with this new enhancement. Finally, we also added support to new reference selection methods for annotations. With this enhancement, I can leverage Creo's powerful intent surface selection method and avoid the need of selecting multiple references one by one. This selection is associative to the design intent, so if changes will be made to the model, the intent object will update in Creo and the same will be also propagated to the functional feature in GDNT Advisor.